<laughs> power. <laughs> no power. Do you really know what power is? No, of course not. Few people do. Women who are so worn out and tired they no longer even care to fake. Yet they tremble with fear in your arms. Because power is always fear. The fear of the one that possesses it, who risks losing it, and who then fears the one who is the victim of it, like a dog being beaten, and then growing old. <laughs> you have come instead of Valenbois, haven't you? Uh, the poor fool. The white bird and all that. <laughs> The enemy of power, my friend, is not liberty, not democracy, and all that miserable nonsense. The enemy of power is the dream. The dream! But you'll never understand that. I mean a real dream, not those common, mind-dulling fairy tales that anesthetize people while you keep them under your heel. I have always been wary of those white birds. All that mythology. I wanted Amazon to be a great modern nation, a country that believes in progress, that believes in science and technology. But these confounded Amazonians revel in that sappy romantic legend, that legend of white birds. I wanted to make the people, I wanted them to be happy, despite their wishes. I won't let you go any further. never stop flying. They are born, they mate, and they die in the hot rising fumes of the volcanoes. Their giant wings continue growing throughout their lives. And some people even claim that long after their death, their lifeless bodies glide on tirelessly. These are but stories, people say. Stories that feed the dreams of the children who live in the Amazon. <laughs> 